Hi, my name is Larry and you're watching Learn It With Larry and today I am sitting in probably the world's worst chroma key setup but that's for a reason because today we're gonna talk about upstream keyers using your Atom Mini. So as you can see I have a makeshift green screen at my back and I have two lights projecting at an angle and I have my Atom Mini setup right here I have my camera right there and I'll show you how you can do the chroma key using Atom. From your software control, under the switcher page, there is an upstream key under the palette tab. Now, when you open the palette tab, there are different types of keying. You have your luma key, your chroma key, your pattern key, and your DVE. Let's start with luma. So luma acts like a downstream keyer except that it has a fly key, meaning you can move your graphics around the screen. How do we do that? So first, we have to make sure that we have assigned a media player. So I've done that. So I've assigned a media player graphic right here and then I assigned it to my media player number one. Now, going back to this, it will ask you what is your fill source. Since that source is in media player number one, all I have to do is call media player number one. It will automatically get a key source, which is the transparency layer of that graphic. That's it. If I press on air in this upstream key tab, then you will see that, hey, I have the graphic. Again, which is very similar to a DSK that you just put in there. But the difference is this one, the flying key. So what does it do? A flying key lets you resize and reposition your your graphics so like what I'm doing now so I can move uh, in the x-axis I can resize this I can move it over the y-axis and I'm just running this around okay but remember when you open the flying key this is very important if you open the flying key the DVE function won't be available anymore because the fly key is a DVE function on its own okay so that's your Luma now, what I'll do is I'll just turn off my flying key and then I will jump to pattern key. Pattern key works like a luma key except that it brings in the, the source or the layer on top of your background in a pattern. For example, let's say let's select a key source and in this case, I'm going to call this still and then I'll replace this with that. So now we have that in our media player number one. Now you go back to your switcher page and again under palettes, upstream key, you go to the pattern settings. It will ask you again for your fill source and in this case, it will be our media player number one which will be our fill source. And it will ask you okay which pattern you want to use now i select this let's say circular pattern right here now if i press on air what happens is i have that image on top of whatever's in your program now i can of course resize this okay i can uh, adjust the symmetry okay if i want to and i can also you know apply some feathering or softness on the edges kind of like that and What's interesting is I can also invert the pattern. Let's say I want to be inside of that background and there's a lot of creativity that you can do with this kind of functions in upstream key. And probably all broadcast switchers will always have this feature that, you know, that's now available in a very small and compact at the mini. Next up is your DVE. A lot of our customers would say, okay, does it have picture in picture? Yes, there is. There's, there's a picture in picture function. Now, when you look at your panel you have your uh, picture in picture area that you can adjust but you can also adjust that in software now if I go to my DVE right here again I have my shot right now in this but let's say I want to have a picture in picture of another source let's say again let's use the media player now under the fill source all I have to do is okay I'll call media player and then that's a DVE if I send that on air now I have that picture in picture that again I can reposition. I can reposition it and make it look like an over the shoulder graphics. I can resize it and adjust the, the Y axis of it, the X axis of it. And there you have it. You have a picture in picture. 
it can also be a uh, reverse picture in picture so how do you reverse it again the upstream key is a layer on top of your background so instead of me in the background i'm gonna use this as a background so how do i do that in this case i'm gonna switch to mp1 in my program and inside my fill source i'm gonna select my camera so now i'm basically in picture in picture and this is the beauty of it your picture-in-picture -picture source is not just images. It can be a video source. It can be any of the camera source. Think about some split screen between your different cameras. Let's say you have a wide shot and then you have a shot of the speaker or probably a presentation and then you have a speaker uh, position on the lower left or lower right or upper left or upper right of your screen. That will provide you a lot of interesting shots or creativity to get what you want from your final output. And last but not the least, is the chroma keying function and this is where we are really excited to share with you the chroma keying functionality of Atom Mini and Atom Mini Pro is the advanced one and there are only two other Atom in the range that has that function it's the Atom Television Studio Pro 4K and the 40 input Atom 8K constellation switcher how does that look like again always think of our layers the first layer, the background layer, let's switch to media player number one. When you go to my software, right here you'll see chroma and then I'll select the camera. If I turn on chroma sample, this is actually my screen right here, okay? Now if I move my cursor, you will notice that this box actually changes color. It actually relates to what he sees in my image, in my shot. So in this case, I have a green screen over here. All I have to do is tell him, Mr. Atom, that's the color that you want to key out of the frame or of the image. If I do that and then say, turn it on, and that goes on air. So now if you can see, I am keyed. In the world's worst chroma key setup, we actually remove the green. The only problem is this side and then this side because there's no green screen on this side. But if I'm sitting in front of a green wall or a green screen i won't have this issue but i can solve this so how do we do that so again go into your software you go to your mask and that's your left and right or left and right wherever you want to look at it but this is my left and this is my right so i can i can just you know assign values for me to crop it so from here uh if i adjust this cursor to uh, you will see that slowly it creeps to the right, okay, because it's cropping it. Now, let's say let's give a value. Let's say let's start with negative 10, so it crops it. You still have stuff here, so let's say negative 9. Huh, I think it's okay. Uh, so, yeah, it looks okay, but yeah, let's crop it a bit more. Let's say negative 8.7. So now I'm sure that that's. Okay, now on this side, on my left, let's say, let's put 8.7 as well, 8.7. There's a bit more stuff left there, so I can just slowly crypt this, and there you have it. Now, I, I'm just looking at this because this is my monitor, my screen, but I'm in a green screen. I'm in a chroma set. So there you have it. I'm now keyed, and I have a background can be an image it can be a video source it can be a powerpoint whatever source you want to use as a background and the main advantage of this is that if you want to use a chroma key setup in your production you don't really need a huge space for you to achieve that and with the advanced chroma keying a function of atom mini you will really get a very good result out of uh, your every key i hope you like this episode again we encourage you to like and to subscribe to our page for more videos like this. And if ever you have any questions, especially if you live in the Middle East, you can always reach to us and we will be able to help you. Watch out for a few more videos after this. And this is Larry. Thank you so much for watching.